There's a lot of evidence um, to suggest that sending on people on training courses is a complete and utter waste of time. People go on a training course, they might learn something, they might enjoy it, they come back enthused, but day-to-day -day intervenes and gets in the way of them actually making use of, of what they've learned. We'd made contact through one of our colleagues here, uh, Donna Lucas, who had gone along to one of their events and was quite impressed. I soon realised that the training would be really valuable to um, many members of the management team here at the college and came back and talked to some of my colleagues. We run a series of one day workshops around the country, uh, normally offered in conjunction with the GISC regional support centres. We can offer those internally for a single institution as well if you want to do that. Uh, it was quite quickly agreed that it would be useful for the entire um, sort of more senior management team uh, to go through uh, the training as a group. We didn't want our training to be, here's the training, you come along, attend, sign off the happy sheets, go away and return to the day job. Now we wanted a solution that we could take people through uh, in considerable numbers. We wanted a solution that was affordable. We wanted a solution that would relate to people's jobs. Happening upon JISC Infinet was was a happy chance, if you like, because we discovered this large cache of resources, a cornucopia of useful things. We uh, have a, a series of online resources that we call info kits, and they're available on the website at www.jiskinfinet.ac.uk. Uh, free access, no registration, no passwords needed, and free to download. The fact that JISC have the info kits on the web um, was one of the reasons why we chose them because you can put a lot of time and effort and resources into producing material to back up training. There were certain skills and techniques that we needed to make sure that our middle managers had that JISC seemed best suited to deliver, both because they had experience elsewhere in education, but also because they could bring to the party experience from the consultants who were delivering it, who'd worked in other sectors. They came out and actually worked with us here at the college and it made it much more real and relevant. Putting it on at the college, using relevant examples from here, all doing it together, and then afterwards talking about, well, what have we done with it? Why don't you use it here? Made that bleed into the job just so much easier, really. When I first introduced the notion that we'd book this training and people were going to be going, you could almost see the groans. So you had to establish the credibility of the uh, training. Um, and I think a number of features help with that. The, the design of it is critical. So the fact that we were able to sit down with colleagues from JISC and say this is what we want, this is the context it's going into. What one finds with many trading providers is they they present something as if it's flexible, but actually it's drawn off the shelf and you get what they've got. Um, the, the strong sense with JISC that whilst there was a core of content that clearly had to remain static, um, there's a, a lot of willingness to amend it to fit the key messages that we wanted to get over. It was really refreshing to see how quickly people's attitude towards the training changed. The evaluations were great and they were really looking forward to the next sessions. The examples were um, based on uh, real things that happen in colleges and universities. The background of the two facilitators that we've used the, um, the most, um, clear, you know, it's clear to see that they have an FE background. Um, and so when we stop and we ask them a question and we use an example, they have a complete empathy for what we've experienced in that. And that they understand some of the frustrations that we have um, in FE. We like the trainers they sent us, they work really well with us. Um, we like the um, approach they took, it's very practical, they seem to understand what we were trying to do. Um, and generally it proved a very successful experience. Um, it's been um, easy to integrate because we've taken um, th the managers through as a team, so now there's a, a common understanding about the need to, um, to process to have a proper process in place and to project plan appropriately. I don't believe you're ever going to prove that a training intervention is the catalyst for changing an organisation. In many ways it's, it's an act of faith. But I do think that what we did with JIS actually helped us meet our training objectives. And given that the training objectives were tied back to what we were trying to do with the organisation, yes, I do think it's worth it. Without the training, I'm not sure we would have moved as, as far as we have in terms of the culture. And at the end of the day, it's the culture of an organisation that influences how people behave.